Hey guys, this is Josh with Alpha Omega Survival School. Um, just coming at you with a video today. Uh, just got these in the mail. Figured I would uh, do a little video about them. Not really a review just yet. I haven't had time to use them in the field. I plan on taking them uh, hunting here in a couple of days um, and maybe kayaking that same day if I have enough time. Uh, and so we'll see what we can do. But these are face shields uh, from a company called Salt Armor. Uh, most of the time they just have their shield SA Co. Let's see if I can find that for you. And so that's their shield there. You might have seen them on Facebook or Instagram, but um, they popped up. You know, you, you, you're kind of curious but also wary at the same time because you don't know if it could be a scam or what it could be, but I clicked on them a couple of times and checked them out and got a little more comfortable with it. I had done some research um, talked to some friends and actually apparently they have them down at the fishing tackle shop uh, on the island uh, not far from where I live so um, I said what the heck they had a deal going um, it said um, 5 for 20 um, I know they do different deals I've seen 5 for 15 since I've seen also on their website their official website that these supposedly go for $20 a piece um, my friend who told me that he had seen them in the tackle shop said they sold those for $20 uh, for a single uh, face shield uh, over there. So I um, definitely believe that the retail value of these is, def is $20 a piece. I did see on the website there that you know a typical pack of five or pack of four is in the $80 range to the $100 range depending on what you get. They also have fleece ones that you can get that are um, that are I think a little bit more expensive in the $25 range. So anyways, after shipping, they were $25, so $5 a piece, um, not bad, you know, at least from the research that I've done on them um, and on the other companies that I've seen. So uh, just wanted to show them to you today. A um, couple of different styles here. We've got hundreds of different styles, and I think that that's one of the coolest things about it is the is the different styles so I was able to pick five I actually bought one more because there was one style that I just regretted not putting in this pack uh, but let's go ahead and go through them real quick um, first of all most basic um, I got the tactical black um, and that's just you know I mean my buddies will go out and we'll play paintball or do stuff at night and you know just a it's a tactical black. It's kind of cool. All black. Throw it on and give it a look. So that's that. Um, tons of different ways you can wear them. I've seen uh, bandanas. I've seen, um, you know, whatever they wear overseas. What do they call it a balaclava or something like that. Balaclava. Um, you can breathe right through it. It doesn't impede your speech at all. It's really good. They say they're SPF 40. That remains to be seen. Uh, we'll see how well they do in the sun. Uh, that's black. And then a lot of mine actually have skulls on them, which I think is really cool. They have lots of different faces. There was a gangster face. Uh, there was um, clown face, which depending on how you look at it, might not be a good idea at <laughs> present times, but blaze orange, of course. Let's see if I can get this on here straight. I'm trying to use the camera lens as a mirror, not very easy. But you can see, kind of cool. But blaze orange skull. Alrighty, kind of moving into some cooler ones. Um, this one, of course, for hunting, and because I enjoy camo, camo skull. Throw that one on. And the thing I like about it is you can flip it upside down if you just want camo. So it's not like it's gonna, um, you know. I think the skull being here kind of 
cancels out the fact that it's camo, but if I'm actually using it hunting, I'm probably going to flip it upside down just so the actual camo part is uh, over my face. And I will say this, the orange, and um, I also have one that's a snakeskin pattern, are on the looser side. I mean, they're not loose, like they're falling off. But the other ones are a little bit more snug, which is fine. They're not tight by any means. And I do have a big head. You know, don't be afraid to say that. Uh, I've heard it all my life. It's, I've come to accept it. Just means I'm full of hot air. It's cool. But, um, you know, they're not tight by any means, especially on me. So, you know, you'll be fine uh, with these. But camo, pretty cool. I like it. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm hoping maybe that the ones that are a little more snug will kind of fit a little bit better as I wear them. Let's see, and of course, um, when the Confederate flag uproar began, I bought a bunch of Confederate flag stuff, um, you know, just kind of got started a collection just in case things went crazy and they put a ban on it, um, but so Confederate flag skull, they do have a Confederate flag one is just plain confederate flag but I think it looks really cool with the skull face on there uh, and I feel like this one's loosening up just a tad for me so that's good and again I'll come back in and uh, you know after I field test a few times and do a review on them Trying to get them on my face as, as best as possible, but you get the idea. It's pretty slick. I like them a lot. Wear them as a neck gaiter. You, know, you can wear several at once, bandana. You can use them as a beanie, you kind of twist it, and then push it down. There's a video on YouTube, Essay puts out about the different ways that you can wear them. So that's pretty sweet. Some of the ways that they say, I believe, are kind of pointless unless you live, you know, in a really dry area or a hot area like the desert. I could see using this out in the Midwest somewhere. Um, wind burn and everything else is a good, you know, these would be good for. They're a real comfortable microfiber, um, really light. I'm also interested to see how hot I get with it on me, um, so I'll be definitely reporting back about that. And last but not least, and I think this one's my favorite, it does not have a skull, it's a snakeskin pattern. That looks pretty sweet. My mom's not a fan of it, she doesn't like snakes. They also have a cobra that is the, the cobra comes up and then your it, the mouth is over your face, which is pretty sweet. But, and this one is by far the most stretchy, I don't know why that is. I don't know if it's a different material or if it's just a bigger, but it doesn't matter. It fits great. This one, it feels lighter, um, lighter of material, and I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with the print. Um, you know, maybe they had to use a different material or, or a lighter material, but they are pretty sweet. Wanted to show these to you. I mean, look how much this one stretches compared to, let's say, the the Confederate one. So, very stretchy, that snakeskin one is. But, um, so the one that I ended up ordering separate, um, I found a deal. It's a promo code SAVE80. I don't know how long they'll have that running. I was able to get another one for just over $5. Um, and it, you know, it, it kind of throws a red flag to me, like are these really worth $20? But the fact that I have friends that, that know that they sell SA Armor brand uh, buffs, basically is what they are, but face shields down there um, for $20 retail um, kind of helps confirm it a little bit for me. But um, I don't know, but the one I ordered is the American flag one and it looked really cool. It's not just your standard flag, which I think you can get but it's like a crazy star stripes banner looking kind of a deal. So it's really cool. I'll do a video on that one when I get it. Um, I'm gonna try and cut this video down a little bit. But uh, anyways, 
thanks for checking out Alpha Omega Survival School. I will be coming back in a you know maybe a week or so with a straight up review after using these in the field, and we'll see just how well they did. Again, thanks for watching. This has been Josh Alpha Omega Survival School. Have a great afternoon. We'll hope to see you again.